Hello friends. Happy Friday. If today is Friday when you're watching this video, I hope it is. If you're watching it on another day, that's okay. We're finishing up our week about monsters. And I have a book today. And then I have a fun game that we're going to play on my whiteboard from my kitchen. But today's story is another one about kind of a disappearing monster. Remember how we read the other one earlier this week about Go Away Big Green Monster? And we used our exclamation point voice and we talked really, really loud. Well, this one kind of has a disappearing monster too, but it's a little bit different. Are you ready? It's called Tickle Monster. Mm, it looks kind of scary. It's got horns, green hands and feet. Look at those teeth. Those kind of nose kind of like a cow. And look at those big eyes. Oh boy. And um, this book is by Edward Mancio, I believe is how I say his name. So he was kind of like our Ed Emberley from our other book. He did the words because he's the author. And he did the pictures. He's also the illustrator. All right, are you ready? This is a fun one. Hey, Tickle Monster, you don't scare me. Maybe if I tickle your horns, look at, I see that dot, dot, dot. What does that mean? Means we have to find out what's gonna come next. The only way we're gonna find out what comes next is when we actually tickle his horns. Are you ready? Put your finger up and let me tickle. can't poke me. Oh, if I tickle your horns, you can't poke me. Look where his horns ended up. Remember he had two yellow horns? Where'd they go? Look at They connected together and they made a moon. <laughs> oh boy. If I tickle your arms, dot, 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 dot. Mmm. What's going to happen next? Should we try it? Ready? Do you think they're going to go up next to the moon? Let's see. <gasps> Where they went. Then you can't catch me. Look at Now they look like trees. There's a brown trunk with a green top on it. Oh, now we have a moon and two trees. And uh, <laughs> look at the poor monster. He has no horns and no arms. Ooh, wonder what's going to come next. If I tickle your feet. Dot, dot, dot. Ooh, boy. Look at his feet kind of look like his arms. See how they're green and, and then they have a long brown strip on them? I wonder if we're going to get more trees. Let's see. Tickle, tickle, tickle. Tickle, tickle, tickle. Oh, we should get more trees. Then you can't run after me. How many trees did we end up with? They're a little hard to see on the screen. One, two, three, four. Yeah, because he had two arms and two legs. And two plus two makes four. Ooh, what would happen if I tickle your teeth dot 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 who wonder his teeth are gonna go ready one two three four five tickles Oop. where did they go you see the trees moved up a little bit now the teeth are down here i wonder what they are i don't know now you can't bite me <laughs> what's left on the monster let's find out if i tickle your Tummy. I wonder what that's going to turn into. Let's see. In between the white teeth. It looks kind of like a roof. What do you think it's going to be? I think it's a building. If I tickle your tummy, you can't swallow me. Ooh, what's left? If I tickle your ears, dot, dot, dot. Okay, you ready? Wonder where those are gonna go. You can't hear me. Look what it turned into. A door and a window. What if I tickle your nose? Ready? <laughs> but you can't smell me. You were right. Alright, what do you think that's gonna turn into? Looks like a house with some bushes or rocks and trees and a moon and oh what could that be? It's missing something. Maybe it's a vehicle. Where are those gonna come from? 
There's something round over here that could turn into the wheels. <gasps> Maybe the eyes. Let's see. If I tickle your eyes. We were right. You can't see me. <laughs> oh. And now, maybe if I tickle what's left of your head. <gasps> You'll finally be gone. Goodbye, tickle monster. Oh, look at what did they turn that part into? That wow, looks like it could be like a trailer or something for the pulled by the car. Or maybe it's another little house. Look at, do you remember what all the parts of the monster were? Yep, there's his nose, his eyes, his head, his teeth. Remember? What are those? His ears. Yep, and this was his body. And he had two arms and two legs. And what was the moon? You remember what the moon was? Yeah, those were his horns, right? Divided in half. Isn't that fun? And that is the end. Let's see. Phew! I can finally go to sleep. <sighs> More monsters, sweetie. But if you ever come knocking on my door, tickle monster, beware. I will have to tickle you again. And what we've been doing with all of our videos this week, friends. Now, if you want to do it again and watch it again, start the video over. You're right. So I brought one more game that I'm going to show you. This is something that you can also play with mom and dad. You have to have one of these boards that you can do the eraser on. So you might have one at your house. Let's see. Let's see if it works. So if I put a little marker mark on there, then look what I can do. I can erase it and I can make it kind of come back off again. I'm going to try to hold it the right way so it's not too shiny. But I thought that I would draw just a really kind of funny little monster. Kind of like it was in our story. We'll make him a head. Maybe we'll make him... Maybe we'll make him a three-eyed monster. Oh boy. We'll give him... Some growly, pokey, pokey teeth. Maybe he needs some horns like our other monster had. And maybe this one's got big ears. <laughs> oh, he needs a nose. Yep, should we make him a big furry body? Mm, yeah, I think that looks pretty good. And then I think he needs um, big legs and big feet. Should we make him some crazy arms? Pointy hands. Oh boy. What do you think? Does it look pretty good? Now what we're going to do is we're going to make him disappear. Do you know what we're going to do? We're going to see if we can figure out the rhyming words. Hmm. Let's erase the first part of my monster that rhymes with bows. Bows horns? Mm -hmm. Bows hands? Mm -hmm. Bo's nose. Ah, did you hear it? Bo's nose. Goodbye, nose. Nose is gone. <laughs> Should we try another one? What parts of his body rhymes with feet? Or with a seat, I should say. What rhymes? I kind of gave it away. What rhymes with seat? Feet. Yep, I kind of gave you that one, didn't I? Seat. Feet. That one was a freebie. I'll make the rest of them harder. Seat, feet. All right, now he has no nose and he has no feet. Hmm. What part of his body would rhyme with borns? Borns fur? Mm mm. Borns teeth? Mm mm. Horns. Horns. All right. Where are his horns? Up on top. Bye, Borns. Horns. There they go. 
They're gone. All right. What part of his body would rhyme with warms? Warms teeth? Mm -mm. Warms fur? Nope. What are those two things sticking out the side of his body? Warms arms. Goodbye, arms. There they go. Oh my gosh, he has nothing to stand on and nothing to wave with. All right. What would rhyme with peers? Why did somebody say it? You got it. Peers. Ears. How many ears does he have? Two big ones. All right. Bye, ears. Our monster's disappearing. Here's a tricky one. What would rhyme with bed? Head. Look at we gotta take this whole head off or a... Alright, you tell me one. Can you come up with a word that would rhyme with eyes? I heard some buys, flies, sighs, tries, nice. Alright, there goes his three eyes. Buys. What would rhyme with teeth? Beeth, weeth, meeth, seeth. Bye, teeth. What's the other part we have left? His fur. What rhymes with fur? Fur, sir, burr, were, cur. What did I say? Bye, fur. Bye, fur. Look at We made the monster disappear. Isn't that a fun game? So if you have a whiteboard at your house, you can play the Disappearing Monster game, too. Well, you all have a wonderful weekend. After this weekend, we only have two more days on Monday, Tuesday that we have to stay home. And then we'll be back together on Wednesday. So next week, I'll bring you two more videos, okay? And then we'll be back together again. I miss you. Bye.